Hello, everyone. Welcome back, and welcome to Ignorant Reviews ASMR Edition. It's been a long time, a year and a half to be exact, and I apologize for the delay, but this is because I was recovering from the last World's Hottest Chocolate Bar review. Let's ruin the rest of my day, shall we? a new day, and instead of destroying my sense of taste, I'll be destroying my sense of smell. How, you may ask? Let's check out this package and find out. The object sounds very secure inside. Gives a nice sticking noise. Let's crack it open, shall we? Say hello to my stinky little friend. This candle smells like my butthole by Ethan Klein of H3H3. This candle is a parody of Gwyneth Paltrow, This Smells Like My Vagina Candle, which was created by her company Goop. If you've never heard of it, that's probably a lot of words to unpack. Goop is a company that convinces women to buy crazy products and also incubate alien eggs. No joke. Let's check out the ad for their jade egg. Step one, wash your egg with soap and water. After, place it in hot water for about 10 minutes. Let it cool. Step two, gently insert the egg into your vagina like you would a tampon. The slightly larger side of the egg first. Work your pelvic floor and feel the connection with your body by squeezing and releasing the egg. This is the alien hatching. You might begin with a 10 to 15 minute session if comfortable. Build up a practice if this brings joy and well-being to you. But what about her candle? What can explain a vagina smelling candle? Let's see what Gwyneth Paltrow has to say herself. It sort of started as a joke. We were on mushrooms and <laughs> I smelled this beautiful thing and I was like, this smells like my vagina. <laughs> right. This smells like my vagina. <laughs> Hopefully not after a long day of marinating in her Iron Man suit. Yeah. Today, we're not supporting Gwyneth Paltrow or her alien empire. No, we're doing something far smellier than that. <laughs> this Smells Like My Butthole Candle was created by Ethan Klein of H3H3, and by all accounts, it does smell like his butthole. Or any butthole in general. And what's even better, the proceeds from this candle isn't going to the demise of the human race. It's going to men's buttholes everywhere by supporting prostate cancer research. Anyways, let's open it up. Already I'm greeted with the smell of dirty ass. Yes, it smells like ass. But the smell is a little more complex than you imagine. It smells like it's been seared in an office chair all day long in swamp like humidity. It smells like after a fresh clean wipe. And maybe a seven layer burrito from last night. 
kind of coppery too, kind of like hemorrhoids. You should get that checked out, Ethan. That was the pre-lighting review. Now let's light it up and see how the scent changes. The wick is lit and like a fuse on a bomb, we'll see when it hits the wax. The wick has just hit the wax and the smell is about the same. It's just getting very strong in here. <clears throat> Power through. <laughs> It does not smell like poop. It it smells more just like unwashed ass. But you know what? That in itself is an achievement. Anyone can bottle a turd. But to bottle unwashed ass? Now that's a talent. As far as intentionally bad smelling candles go, this is a 10 out of 10.